our lesson today about types of reproduction. At the beginning, at the end of this lesson, students will be able to state that there are two types of reproduction, asexual and sexual. Second objective is they will be able to give examples on each type of reproduction. So this is the whole lesson about types of reproduction, the difference between them and examples about every coin. But at the beginning, let's see what do we mean by reproduction. Reproduction means the process of producing offsprings that are similar to the parents. Reproduction, it means that when one living thing gives me new living things, the new living things, they will be similar to the parents. This is the meaning of reproduction. It's the production. It's when one living thing or it's when living things give new living things. When it happens, reproduction happens only when an organism reaches maturity and adulthood. Yani we have a certain stage where reproduction can happen. Before this stage, it will not happen. As you know, stages of living things, they start with a baby. This baby, it can be a newborn, such as a mammal, or it can be an egg if it's in the animals that lay eggs. Then when the baby or the newborn uh, grows, it will uh, be young. And finally, after the youth stage, we have the adulthood or we have the adult stage. So when the living thing is mature, it's adult, its body is complete, it will not grow more. At this level, at this stage, reproduction can happen. Before, it doesn't happen because its body is not ready yet to make this reproduction. So reproduction means when living things give me new living things, such as when a cat or cats give me kittens, when dogs give me puppies, when lions give me cups, and so on. Let's see reproduction. After showing the meaning of reproduction, let's discover its types. We will talk in this video about the first type of reproduction, which is called sexual reproduction. So the first kind, the first type, its name is sexual. Let's see why it's called sexual and what do we mean by sexual. First of all, you know that as living things, we have many cells in our body. And these cells, they help us to stay alive. As you know, we have trillions of cells in our body. Every cell, it has its own function. But in every body, in every living thing, we have special cells. These special cells, their only function, their only job, their only role is to make reproduction, is to make new living things. These cells, they differ according to the sex. What do we mean the sex? Yani, Either this living thing, is it a male, Rajul, or it's a female, yani, Imra. So it differs between these two sex. Let's see. If the living thing is female, yani, it's a girl, it's a woman. So the sex cell, we call it ovule. Again, the all women, either they are plants, either uh, they are animals, either they are human, all the female, they have one cell, one kind of cell that is called ovule. This ovule, it will help the living thing to make their production, yani to give new living things. This is for the female, which is the woman or the girls. As for the other kind, we have the male, yani the man or the boys. The cells that are in the man or in the boys, we call them sperm. So sperm is found in the body of males, in the body of the man, in the body of boys. And I have the ovule, which is found in the body of the females, in the body of the women, in the body of the girls. Akid, akid, you will not find ovule in the male. You will not find the sperm in the female. And every sex, every gender, kill no in living things, or male, or female, it has its own cells. So... What are sex cells? By the way, نحن سميناهم sex cells لأنهم هن they determine بحدد the sex تبع living thing is it male or female. 
سو so, اذا هيدا ليفينج ثينك عنده السبرم معناتها السكس اللي له ميل حيكون او مان او بوث اما اذا الليفينج ثينك هيدا عنده اوفيول انسايد اتس بودي معناتها السكس تبع هالليفينج ثينك حيكون في ميل يعني حيكون جيرل يعني حيكون هو سو سكس سيلز ذي ار سبيشال سيلز ان اور بودي سو هول عباره عن سبيشال سيلز مش اني سيل بيكوز ذير اونلي فانكشن از تو ريبروديوس الله خلقهم كرمال بس وان جوب ويتش از ريبرودكشن هيلبينج ان ميكينج نيو ليفينج ثينكس سبير از ا سكس سيل فور ميلز فور ذا بويز فور ذا مان اوف يول اتس ا سكس سيل فور فيميلز يلي هن الجيرلز او الومن ذيس از ذا فيرست كايند اوف سيلز سكس سيل ذا سكند كايند اوف ذا سيل وي كول ات بودي سيلز بودي سيلز يعني they are found in all living things either they are female or they are male they will be common between both yani male will female they have muscle cells because they help them to move il male will female animals and the human they have nerve cells because they help them in the sensation they uh, help them in many other jobs all male and female they have bone cells in order to support their body to Uh, uh, make uh, blood cells in order to uh, make uh, the bones hard by keeping the calcium. All living things, male and female, they have blood cells that can protect their bodies from germs. Uh, they uh, carry the oxygen, they uh, carry uh, nutrients, carbon dioxide, and so on. So body cells, they are cells in our body that are responsible for different functions. These body cells, as I told you, body cells, we call them body cells. I know they are found in all bodies, human and animals. They are common between the male and the female. They are, or they perform, or they make different functions, movement, sensation, support, uh, carrying oxygen, protection, and so on. So just to uh, summarize, we can say that we have two kinds of cells all the cells in our body they are divided into two kinds and this is very important to understand the kinds of reproduction the first kind i will call it body cells and the second kind i will call it sex cells what is the difference between them the first one body cells the cells they are found in both male and female yani girls and boys the second one is sex cells they are either in male such as sperm or they are in females only such as the ovule their only function is for reproduction yani they make nothing but reproduction while here the body cells they have different functions such as sensation such as carrying the oxygen carrying the nutrients breathing digesting the food movement support whatever okay this is for the two kinds of cells and both of them they are inside the living things Let's see now the first kind of reproduction. After introducing the type of cells, let's see. Sexual reproduction. I have two living things. I have the male and I have the female. I have the boy, I have the girl. I have the man, I have the woman. How do they reproduce? At the beginning, the two cells that are responsible for their production, they must meet. They cannot stay everyone in a body and they will make reproduction. They must meet, they must join together. For example, for example, in the, uh, let's say in the fish. In the fish, I have fish male and fish female. The fish uh, male, it throws its sperm outside its body in the water, in the sea. And also the fish female throw its eggs, its ovules in the water. In the same place, Akid. The sperm and the ovule now they can join in the water. When they join, this joining 
means that sexual reproduction happens. So again, sexual reproduction happens. It happens only when sperm and ovule join together. If they didn't join, I don't have any sexual reproduction. Or pay attention, and when we call it sexual, because the two sex cells are involved. يعني أنا بهيدا reproduction sperm وال ovule هني معنيين بالأمر عشان أكسم ما يتأ sexual لأنه أصلاً هني اسمه sex cells. فهني كرمال يلتقوا مع بعضهم لازم يظهروا من البادز كرمال يلتقوا. مثل ما قلنا مثل الفش الميل بظهروا السبرم اللي قلهم على المي بكبوهن على المي والفيميل بكبوا الأوفيول اللي قلهم بالووتر صاروا الاثنين بالووتر they will meet together and so sexual reproduction happens as you can see in the picture this is the male sex cell and this is the female sex cell اللي هي الأوفيول the sperm and the ovule they will join together when they join they will give me one cell because they are uh, they net together so the cell that is uh, that results at the end from this meeting من بعد ما بيتحدوا مع بعضهم بيصيروا وحده هيدي السل الوحده انا بسميها fertilized egg هيدي الفيرتيلايزد egg هي the new beginning of a new living thing من هيدي السل بيخلق عندي البيبي بيخلق عندي السيد بالبلانت بتخلق عندي البيبي بالانيمال وبالهيومن. So sexual reproduction happens only in the presence of sex cells. إذا مش موجود السبرم ومش موجود الأوفيول ما عندي sexual reproduction. So to happen, sperm and ovule must meet and join together. لازم يلتقوا لازم يتحدوا مع بعضهم. طيب let's see the steps. كيف بتصير عملية السكشوال reproduction. First of all, أول ستيب قلنا أكيد لازم يكون في عندي joining أو meeting so sperm and ovule mate they must meet together they must join together number two when they join together one cell and one ovule when they meet as a result these two sex cells they will make for me one cell which is called fertilized egg this joining when the cell and the uh, when the sperm and the ovule join together, I call this fertilization. عشان هي بتعطيني fertilized egg. So, شو يعني fertilization? Fertilization لما السبرم والأوفيول بيلتقوا لما بيتحدوا لما بيتصلوا مع بعضهم. هيدي العملية اتحادهم مع بعضهم بسميها أنا fertilization. هاي الصورة. هاي عندي السبرم وهي عندي الأج أو يلي هي بقلب الأوفيول السبرم والأوفيول when they meet هون أنا بهيدي الستاب هيدي اسمه fertilization أوكي؟ طيب هيدي الفرتيلايزيشن بس صارت خلقت لي one cell هيدي السل اسمه fertilized egg هيدي الفرتيلايزد egg نتيجه لانه السبرم والاوفيول التقوا مع بعضهم مثل ما انتم شايفين بس طبعا انتم شايفين هون ماني سبرمز هني ماني سبرمز حيجوا بس بس واحد يلي حيعمل جويننج مع الاوفيول لانه هي ما بتقبل الا بس واحد سو so, لما هالواحد سبرم ويل جوين وذ ذا وان اوفيول وان اند وان وين ذي ميت they will give me one cell which is called fertilized egg أو بسميها zygote it has two names zygote or fertilized egg بعدين what happened let's see one cell is produced من بعد ما صارت fertilization من بعد ما نعملون joining together برجع بعيد لي join together اسم عملية اتصال الفرتيلايزيشن بس يتصلوا ويتحدوا مع بعضهم بيعطوني سل وحده اسمها فيرتيلايز ايج يلي هي الزايجوت اخر شيء هيدي الزايجوت شو حيصير فيها هيدي الزايجوت ببلش بيصير لها ماني بروسيسز بتخضع لكذا عمليه لكذا ديفيجن تنقسم 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 لتصير ماني 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 واخر شيء ات ويل بي ا كومبليت اورجانيزم يلي هو كومبليت بيبي ايذر ذس بيبي ات ويل بي انسايد ان ايج اور ات ويل بي از ا نيو بورن يعني انسايد ذا تامي اوف ذا مام Okay, so I have four steps for the sexual reproduction. 
first i must have male or female or i must have the sex cells اللي هن السبرم والاوفيول و they must meet first step in they must meet second step هيدا الميتنج بسميه انا فيرتيلايزيشن بس انا عمل لهم ميتنج صار في عندي وان سيل هيدي الوان سيل بسميها فيرتيلايزد ايج او الزايجوت اخر ستيب الزايجوت شو بصير فيه بلش نعمل لهم ديفيجن بلش ينقسم كل شوي بينقسم ليزيد العدد ليزيد ليزيد until it will be a complete living thing or a complete organism. This is about the sexual reproduction. If you like this video and you find it helpful and fruitful, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to like this video.